Hello everyone, welcome back to my Unreal Engine uh, third person shooter series. So today I'm going to show you how to change the camera uh, between the normal third person camera mode and the aim down side like this. When I press the right mouse button and hold it, the character will go to this shooting aim down side mode and when I release the right mouse button it will be like this it will work even when I am running also and this episode is sponsored by these generous patreons thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me ok so at the moment when I press my right mouse button, this is what happens. I show the cursor, but my camera doesn't change at all. So that's the part I am going to look into today. Alright, so today let's see how to uh, move the camera to the aim down side. And then, um, yeah basically the aim down sight so after that maybe we will have to do some changes to the guns pointing direction to align with the camera's middle point and the guns facing direction so this is aim down enable and disable in the ch soldier and as my player car is also a child class of this child actor of this seer soldier i have overrided i have overridden this aim down event this is the aim down event in the seer soldier and i have overridden that in the child uh, blueprint of this seer player uh, to facilitate the camera changes all right so here what I have only done is changing the toggle reticle to show the reticle on and off right now one more thing I'm going to do here changing the camera I want to change the perspective of this camera to the position of this camera compared to the character when I'm in the aim down sight so first mm, I need to test that so how should I do that well let's see so I'll call this spring arm spring arm um, normal and I'll duplicate that one I'll call that one spring arm ADS which stands for aim down sight and I'll put camera as a child of that with zero like this uh, here uh, what I am trying to do is testing what's the best way to do the aim down sight so I'll reduce this to 150 and let's see how that looks here like this so now i think i should move my camera a little bit to the right or left depending on the player's choice i should give that as an option so if the player like to player like to aim keep the body in the left side or toggle that to the right side i should give that option okay so first let's test with the left side the body is in the left side so for that I'm gonna have to move this one mm -hmm. How? with the socket offset or target offset let's see I'll first queue something like 20 is that enough maybe 40 let's see now how that looks is 
is this good enough? I'm not sure. I actually I'm targeting for a view more like this one so I'll keep that in my other screen for reference and so here yeah I think my camera should go more closer to the character all right so I'll increase or decrease this one to 70 is that too much okay let's see now okay this is better but I think I should move my camera upwards a little bit also maybe I should increase this one to 50 and in this set 10 all right right this is better now the only problem is that my gun doesn't look like I am pointing to the place that is pointed by this reticle it's like I'm pointing somewhere else I will fix that soon but let's first uh, fix this transition okay all right now how to do that uh, how to change between these two spring arms dynamically so first uh, I'll put this camera here like this and I will be back like this yeah I need to fix that problem this still might turn in the camera uh, turning the character to the aiming direction is not perfect it's okay in this case but not okay if I quickly move the camera like this all right I will address that problem later for now I'll focus on this one so right here I'll change the cameras if I am aiming down that means I should to attach to component this should not be the parent parent is this And the component is no, not the actor I should use the other method attach component right parent is this one target is this one and location and rotation I'll keep world everything I will keep world if I'm disabling the aim down side I should do the same but in that case my spring arm should be uh, not this one sorry the other one 
to normally spring up this one and after that I'll get another reference to my camera and then I'll do this move component two. so here I'll change the relative location and rotation and I'll give point three with the scene and is out mm. right let's see what happens now right it worked but the disabling part didn't work let's see all right I have to connect this one also right so this is basically it this is speed too much I can decrease the speed 0.5 let's try Okay, so I'll stop this episode at this point. And uh, if you like to support my work, you can get the membership of my Patreon club. Link would be in the description below. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. See you in the next episode. In the next episode, I will address how to align the reticle and the gun pointing direction.